Hello, everyone. Squee here with Inferno. Hello, I come to greet you again, mortals. And welcome back to Let's Play XCOM. So, Inferno, there have actually been a lot of um, things you missed. Uh, oh, like? Like uh, the... Uh, hang on. Let me go over here. The, the treadmills have actually been moved a little bit to the left to make room for the uh, this what? second bench. I know, I'm not necessarily. I was so against that second bench. I can't believe you got it. When it I wasn't was... that wasn't me. It was a logistics thing. I was yeah, busy. Yeah. Uh, there is more alcohol variety though. That's always a okay. plus. Right, um, yeah, good. Yeah. They. They got, look at the guys, these crappy recliners. I, I I asked for lazy boys. That's what we got. War, huh? Yeah, but, yeah I know. Like, come on. Requisition us the right tools to do the job. <laughs> yeah. How do you expect me to run a war if you don't even have a foot rush that rises up from this thing? Oh, man. I bet you that stupid TV isn't even 1080p either. It's probably 720. I asked for a 4K. I, these soldiers are giving their lives. They at least deserve a 4K screen to play their Call of Duty on. God. I like to think our soldiers have better taste. <laughs> Actually, you know what I haven't done in a really long time? Play Call of Duty? Officer training school. <laughs> oh, yeah. Company officers. Oh, I can promote people to captains now. Now, remember, your current lieutenants uh -huh. have to at least do five missions oh i'm not i'm not i'm not worried about that at the moment anyway we've got our lieutenants are, are good enough as it is later on i'll start getting captains and getting their second in commands but we're talking a few episodes down the road. you're nine ranks up away from getting squad size two though that's where, excellent where do i see the ranks total ranks 91 right oh, underneath up yes yeah. i need this squad size two so much yeah, so you need you need to promote yourself nine more peeps and I do. Um, I finished the uh, um, the research on the advanced computers. Okay. Uh, it didn't get me any sort of flying capability, so now I'm doing oh, advanced yeah. aerospace concept. I was I was going between that and gauze. Uh, I mean, advanced pulse weapons. Yeah. Uh -huh. And or precision pulse weapons. And I realized, okay, look, uh, either I, I, I could get the laser sniper rifle and give me one extra point of damage, or, since I've already got a, a enhanced ballistics coming, I just use enhanced ballistics and work on the aerospace Bingo. stuff. So, there you go. Yeah. Um, what else? What else? I sold a little bit of Illyrium for two engineers, which is nice. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm making targeting computers. Nice. Uh, I've got carapace armor coming... Mm -hmm. Come down the line. Coming down three the days line. And then Two and five three days, days one and that. eight days, yeah. Um, enhanced ballistics, uh, targeting computer. Uh, I, oh, I, and 80 alien metallurgy. Great. Yes. So now you get more alloys. Yes, 14 days from now. So that'll be nice. And other than that, just keep on keeping on. Let's do it. Let's find us some aliens <laughs> to shoot. What's you know oh. got? Oh, exalt. Exalt. It took $170 of our cash reserve. We didn't have $170. Didn't you have like 10? I don't know. Let's go find out. 10, I'm minus 160. Oh, <laughs> oh my right, god. Good news. Good news. You can well, if you beat this mission, you do get at least 100. Right. But the more. thing the thing is, is that uh this mission won't be for a few days. Um uh, now here's the question. Good. I just sent Aegis Squad out, but I did say they were going to be our dedicated exalt. Well, do I, do I, well, he, no, here's the thing, because it does take, I think, six days. Do I send Aegis out and then use Animus for the next else. squad? Yeah. Uh, I don't know, dude. That, it's up to you. I, I, I don't really have much feedback with that. I think each squad has someone who can act as a covert agent, but if you did specifically make someone for really that role, then... Yeah, um... Here's my thinking. I do kind of want to send Jarek out again, um, especially since I think Aegis Squad is really well equipped to handle Exalt. They've got a really okay. great sniper. They've got several gunners, and so I might do that, um, and then use Animus for the next mission. Um, yeah, squads. I don't want you to feel like I'm purposely overlooking you or playing favorites or anything like that. I just think that Aegis Squad has been geared towards Exalt. Um, let's make sure they're not. Uh, fatigued though yeah that's important although right now you just want to send your make sure your agent isn't fatigued like you said you have six days that will wear off any other fatigue agents might have yeah in fact yeah two days three days or four days one day but see yeah Jarek's 
fatigued for four days. Oh, so well, then there you go. All right, so you know You're what? Good. I'm gonna send Animus. Okay. Animus will be the the um, the exalt squad yep. today. And uh, we decided. I'm assuming we decided that uh, infantry was a really good person to send. Engineer is another good one. Um, and yeah, we yeah. I think with our discussion, yeah, it was. Those are the two classes that I think really excel as agents. So it'll either be Kem and Quan. Let's check Excuse them out. Me. Excuse me. Oh, uh, it's almost past the commander's bedtime. <laughs> so let's look at Cam Cameron Quan, and if they're, I think if they're good enough, we'll send them. If not, we'll send an engineer, executioner, lock and load, gunslinger, light them up. Oh my gosh. Ooh, gunslinger! Wow. Okay. Cam then yeah, Cameron Quan, you're our. I think we chose that for that reason, I believe. Yeah. 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 So. Yeah, that's why I thought you said you had. Uh, you had good agents for pretty much every squad. Oh, I'm in the wrong place. Although you should have... That's weird. Oh, yeah, send agent. Okay. All right, so Cameron Kwan, you are going. Uh, good luck. Uh, I want to check her loadout. Yeah, obviously, first. She uh, high cap mags. That gives her lock and load. Um, Why isn't she using her laser pistol? Because you, maybe oh, you don't I, have any lasers or pistols have free. Any free. Yes, that's a good, good. Uh, um, let's Go just, to the people who were obviously fatigued, because they were the ones using them last, right? Right. Okay, not you. I can't believe I didn't give you a uh, a pistol, laser pistol. Oh no, you don't. You, you don't even carry your laser pistols. Um, it wasn't Helsing. It was not Sway Creasy. I mean, did you have any laser pistols? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's not a problem. It, I know Jarek Jackson. No, no, it's not Jarek Jackson. Um, well, why don't you go through here? Why don't you just select one? Uh, here we go. Gwen Lemure, do you have one? No, go oh, to no. your loadout. Oh, just a second. This is uh -huh. faster. Go to your. Okay, pick anyone. Pick anyone. All right. Now press loadout. And then just go sideways. Now, so, yes, that's gonna be so much faster. Then you guessing and be like, well, did he have it? Did he not? Nah, nah, nah. Uh, there there we, we go. go. Boom. All right. There we go. So then, now, an Animus Squad. Now this may it. this may mean that you are um, not going to be doing your mission on this on this video. It may be next video that you do it. Oh, we'll see you. what else pops up. Exactly. So we're gonna give you the laser pistol. Um, yep. We're gonna give you. Let's see. Your hit points are four. You have. You can't do anything to increase hit points. The alloy, the vest, or right, whatever, right. doesn't do. That. So I suggest either smoke or flashbang as a defensive. Then, in case she gets surrounded, and she can get the hell out of there. Honestly, yeah, I'm thinking. I was thinking maybe a scope, but she's already got eighty eight. And, and Executioner. Yeah, you yeah. need uh, something defensive, frankly, because she only has four hit points. A.K.A. one hit, she's dead. Period. So let's do Flashbang and a Smoke. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. Quan. Good, oh, good luck. You tell the men we can't have them bringing back alien... <laughs> Just a second. Not yet, Quan. Now good luck. Yes, now good luck. Bye. Say hello to India for me. India. So now we get to see if there's another mission. If there's another mission, we'll send out Trident. Okay. You kind of have to send out Trident. I hope there's not a mission for at least two days. Excavation complete. See, now that you hope, it's going to have an excavation. Oh, complete. but I have no money. <laughs> no, you sure don't. Yes. Ooh, oh, you got three alloys and 14 bucks back. Whoa, now you're only negative 46. 146. <laughs> yay. yay. Oh, and targeting computer. Very nice. $4. Woo, yay. Now negative 142. And enhanced ballistics. Very nice. Whoa. I'm not doing the math. Fuck it. 136. Commander, the council's oh. requested situation room. This is a mission. Yep. Curious to see what it is. 
According... Oh, founding lights. Let's see. According to Dr. Shin's report, the transponder device provided by Zhang is tied into the God. navigation system of an alien battleship approaching our atmosphere. The doctor believes deploying a series of modified transponders could provide you with the means of diverting the battleship before it reaches the target. We will, so, Trident, you are going on the train mission. Oh, I hate the train mission so much. I don't know how much help I'm going to be on this because I had to redo it a few times. I hate it. Oh, my God. Well, it's not I a matter of... I hate so much. Yeah, it's not no a idea. matter of uh, beating it, per se. Of course, I haven't done it on Long War Mod. It's a matter of beating it in time. Yeah, not only beating it in time, but making sure no one dies while doing so. Well, we do have shivs. That might help a bit. So, one thing I do know about this is that the men are all over the goddamn place. Yes. You might consider giving everyone a med pack. You might consider that. It's up to you, but it's going to save you a lot of hassle. Well, yeah, we'll see about that. Uh, I, I, I think that might be a really good call. Um, let's go ahead and try to still damage, but we're going to go ahead and use Thunder 10. Okay. Because I have nifty new abilities like targeting computer. Go into the, uh, yeah, that button there. Plus 10 aim if it does not move. Neat. Uh, it doesn't have, don't you have more stuff? I think you Oh, yeah, have yeah, to, I need to uh, do the, make items available. Yeah. So we're going to give you an alloy belt, a targeting yeah. computer, and a smart shell pod. Oh, man, without moving, it's 85? That's sexy. Yep. Uh, no, 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 Actually, no, 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 it'll be 87. No, 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 actually, uh, yeah, exactly, it'll be 87, something like that. Uh, because I think it gives you a little bit, and then more if you don't move. Because right. without this, it's uh, only 5. With, it's another 2, plus oh, 10 you if you don't move. Nice. So, that'll work. Great. Uh, Rocketeer is nice, so we'll take Kotobuki. I am taking the best I can find on Trident. This isn't a a chance to level people up, just yeah. so everyone knows. So this, this is a we can't lose this mission. So we're okay. sending assaults are going to be nice. Scouts yeah, are going to be nice. Actually. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. Both of those are huge important. Let's see. Especially uh, scouts with their mobility. Holy shit, are they ever important? So let's go ahead and get. Well, we got to get Rebel, uh, David a female anyway. He's the flipping squad leader. Yes. So, um. Then let's get. Um. Uh, Zero assault. Trying to think of my best assault. Probably a Basiyama. Well, look at. You can compare the two of them. Yeah, alright, let's see here. Where are you, Basiyama? Alright. You are. 69 aim, 48 will, 15 defense, mobility 9, hit point 7, plus 2. I mean, you've got great mm -hmm. defense and hit points. I'm not crazy about that mobility, though. No. Let's see here. Um, and then my other assault is Rico. And do I have? Yeah, Percy Simmons and Rico. So let's look at Percy. You could probably afford to take two assaults, frankly. I, I probably will. Let's see here. Because mobility, key. 11 plus 1, 12 defense, 7 hit points, 60 aim, 57. Not bad. Run and gun, close combat specialist and gunslinger. That's not bad That mobility is much better. Plus those really good HP, you can even give them a tactical vest. Right. Or wait, don't you have some armor? That I do. Is, yeah. I do. And so then let's look that. at Rod Rico Rodriguez. Rico... Where are you, Rico? There you are, Rico Rodriguez. Um, twelve mobility, nine defense, sixty-three aim. All less lot. He's a lot less ranked, though. I like yeah. his mobility, but he doesn't have the skills I think we need. So, Rico, you're gonna be sitting this one out. I do need to, and I promise I will take you on other missions later because you do need to level up. But this is yeah. not the time for that. It's not the time where to play. So, uh, let's actually take Abasiyama and, uh, Percy. So, Abasiyama... ...and Percy. Where are you? There you are. 
Okay, now, let's see. So we've got the Rocketeer, we've got the Scout, we've got two Assaults, we've got a Shiv, we've got two more. We need a Medic, and then the last one, maybe uh, an Engineer? Mm -hmm. Or an Infantry. Oh, God, either is good, but I'm, I'm going to assume that you're going to be moving and firing a lot, mm -hmm. which means an infantry stay still and fire twice might come less into play. So, so maybe I would, assault. I'm with you. I would skew, no, I would skew towards the gren grenadier. I mean, yeah, I'm sorry, maybe grenadier. Um, all right, so let's get our medic, mm -hmm. and let's get... Um, is it, is it Ludwig? Uh, don't I have two? Do, I think I just have one engineer on this squad. Yeah, so then... Uh, man, let me be absolutely sure. Sorry, everyone. I know setup's taking a bit of time, but let's see. Yeah, so Ludwig Van Damme. Where are you? Right there. Right? No. That's Ludwig Friedberg. What? Hang on. Uh, Dietger Ludov. Oh, Dietger is who I'm looking for. There we go. You're here first. Your commander. You all look alike to the commander. Ah, you all do. You all sound bad. All right. Um, so, loadouts. Uh, I think I'm good with this. 81 aim plus 7. Uh, rocket launcher, shredder rocket, and a scope. I think that's fantastic. You don't want to rock out two rocket launchers? Mm. You're not worrying about resources in this, are you? That's true. All right, good idea. You want to kill things as fast as possible. And rocket I still get launcher. a shredder rocket, so. Yeah, and you have 85. Yeah, I think that's, yeah. I think that's my suggestion, at least. I, I'm all for that suggestion. Um, oh, she won't have a med kit, though. That's all right. Mm. Maybe the med kit and just take the hit on the aim. The hit on the aim. Oh, the scope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see without the with the med kit. It's 70 75. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. It's better than having to deal with poison. Yes. All right, scout, Mr. Scout. Um now for him, do you? He has a mobility of fourteen. Do you want to save that really good armor for your assault guy? Probably, right? Yeah. Okay. So let's give you a med kit. Although, didn't you have some more armor that came in? No. That was made. No. Yeah. Well. Sure? Yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah. There's there's two carapace armors and then one that's just one with a grappling hook. Okay. That's the same, really. Um, either way. But won't the one with the grappling hood give you the same armor but better mobility? I maybe you might be right. Let's take a look at that. Um, do I want to give him an AP grenade? Um, the AP does more damage, so maybe that's worth it. Yeah, let's stick you with an AP grenade. Um, let's see here. Yeah, Kestrel armor it does yeah, give it gives you, more you one, mobility. Gives you two more mobility, so why not? Why not give it to him? Now his mobility is seven freaking team. Yeah, I'm for that. Yeah. Yeah. That could actually make that might make you win. Frankly. Right. So this new body armor was developed using what we've learned from the alloys employed in the alien ship. It should prove to be both lighter and stronger than anything we've used in the past. Nice. So, very nice. Give you that. Gonna give you that. Um, instead of a flashbang, I'm gonna give you. Oh, she has grenadier. She has the grenadier trait. Oh, so he grenades. Sure. And a med kit. Okay. You get the other carapace armor. Shotgun. Mm, let's keep the shotgun on you for now. I may not have enough rifles. His aim is 60, frankly. Yeah. Um, you are a gunslinger, so let's give you that. Yep. Um, let's go ahead and give okay. you... Let's keep the AP grenade on you and give you a, a 
The thing is, I I, I I will have smokes on my medic, but I'm I'm more worried about offense than defense at the moment. You really do. You have to. You're gonna have to just pile through this and just kill them all and just keep chugging, because the longer you wait, the more likely you're gonna lose. All right. You. I'm probably gonna keep you just the way you are, cause you're beautiful. Oh, and just you're stacked. The way you are. All right, um... No singing, no singing to the troops, please. Aww. Aww, Inferno. No, he just has Sapper, so you definitely want to have him to keep the AT grenades, because that will destroy a lot more cover than usual. So that could be really handy. So... I might I might actually not give him a med kit. Okay. Because those grenades... Oh, those grenades. I might actually just give him four HEs. No, two APs, two uh, HEs is a good yeah. mix. Yeah. All right. Okay, guys. Uh, everyone's got the weapons they need. Uh, can I give you? No, I couldn't even if I wanted to. So. There you go. Running gets gonna be handy. Mm hmm. Okay. Let's do this. I don't expect my shift to make it out of this. Bye. Don't give money to hobos. Going to the subway. You don't want yeah, to get it. It's such a long the flight day. there. It is. We're heading it into China so for the next operation. Oh man. Alright. Now, All right. this time I know that the time limit is actually to get to the bridge. The, the one time I did this mission, I failed because I like, thought yeah, that, I, uh, yeah. Yeah, I thought the time limit was to get to the, to get to the last device, well, and then you had to get to the last well, device and do something else. I was like, oh well poop. The tricky thing is that you want to get to these devices, but you also don't want to trigger tons of aliens too, right? So this, yeah. there's going to be a, a fine line. But definitely have your scout be the one going up ahead. You have 10 Alien turns to get to the end. For the oh city, my god. And we don't have much time to respond. Using the device provided your scout, by Sam, though, like, look at his movement! I know. It's so good, you got to utilize that. He's going to be your, your bomb However, disposal the guy, he has to. Get them in position fast enough is by using the commuter rail network running through the city. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You know what, actually? I could pop a scanner down here. Yeah, save one in case of squiddies, but yes, do that. Whoa, 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 game, game, game. Calm down. Out. There's one. Okay, there's his first one right there, by the way. Let's... As far down as you can. We've got eyes on the AO. Nothing. Unless it's over here. There's your first objective, though. Yep. If there's nothing there, then you can bring your other people forward a lot more aggressively, frankly. Right. Let's actually... No, I'm not going to run and gun you yet. No, 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 not yet at all. All right, now bring everyone else up right where the other two are, because you know no one's within those sight lines, right? So you can even dash them. Uh, my game is kind of behaving. You know what? I'm going to save. My game is, is being buggy. Mm. Doing this game? Whoa, game, game. Okay. Got it. Moving. All right, Shiv, Mr. Shiv. Ah. It's probably just the camera control screen. All right. Um. You know, what? I'm just gonna get you guys here. It's fine, yeah. They're, you haven't triggered anyone. And you're not going to trigger them, trigger them behind them there, and now they're going to be in a lot better position to move and fire, which you're definitely going to have to do next turn. Moving to designated coordinates. All right. All right. Mr. Scout, you can't reach that. But have them move. Have them move inside the 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 train there. Take that half cover. Yeah, yeah. right there. He can move yeah, away no. if he needs to, and if not, he can get the first one. Right. This is the train we're going to be right. using to move the transponders. He's going to trigger someone ideal, going up there. But each of the now all you have to do is really just put your rocket launcher person in a good position for them to fire. Oh wait. 
Let's see here. Um, hang on, I'm gonna save and, and reload this. This is this is going to get someone killed if I keep trying to play with this weird uh -huh. wonky camera. All right, so then let's try and load. Uh, this one. Nope, still okay. Hang on, everyone. Switch the cam. Switch the camera around. Press the, the Q and E keys. It's not. It's not that. It's everything's running very clunky. I have no idea what's going on, but something weird is happening. Um, hang on, everyone. We're going to regale you with our uh, incredible. Not only skills at combat, but skills at entertaining. Uh, I did not come prepared for that. <laughs> you might be in trouble. <laughs> Inferno's like looking around, like I um I was not I was not hired for this. Um, I was not I was not told I would be a clown. <laughs> oh, Inferno! I thought that was just assumed. It's natural. I've played a clown before, not like a, a birthday clown or a circus clown, but like a Shakespearean clown. Really? Yep. Uh, yep, yep, yep. I don't think I've ever had the opportunity to play a clown. Yeah, old, old school clowns are kind of ridiculous because they're, um, they're very sarcastic. And uh, actually, my clown was very bleak. Ooh. Like he, he, you know the guy who uh, who just makes inappropriate humor. Uh -huh. That was pretty much him. He would make like puns about death after someone just croaked and stuff like that. Okay, th there's something wrong here. It's pro. Well, I don't know. It's not the camera I'll angle. Tell you. Yeah. All right, we'll just keep trying to go. All right. Um. You actually could go right here. Let's sure. Do Although you dashed them. Yeah, but I mean, with that scanner there, I'm not afraid of activating anything. Uh, okay. All right. Let's get our medic over here. Moving to position. Okay. Let's get the shiv. Actually, I kind of want the shiv mirroring alongside the train. Sure. Instead of in it. Yeah. So let's get sure. you right here. I suggest moving your rocket launcher to where that bench is, though, because she needs she's gonna need a really good line of sight of whatever else is there. So you might have like to right dash. Her. Yeah, right there, exactly. I'm good with that. There we go. Now she can fire next turn, and anything along that side of the the track, she'll smoke. You don't want to have her firing through right. the train, but everyone else, I think you can move up just fine. Once again, you've never triggered anyone, so you don't have to worry about cover just yet. And you don't have a whole lot of turns. You here? Like, that's the tricky thing. That's what I, I hate about this. You can't approach this like a regular mission. You gotta just go, 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 go. Like, from now on, you have to hit a... In order to succeed, you're gonna have to... You have eight turns and three triggers. Yeah. You're pretty much gonna have to get a... Trigger one of those things every two turns to be safe. So that's what it is. So you have to get one at there. Yeah, you see, he's fast enough. He can move to there and this. trigger it. Why? But why did you do it on that side? You're probably going to get flank, flanked. Um, I was trying to get him up closer. Ooh. Yikes. Okay. All right, well, I got good news, I suppose. I think you can just trigger. I mean, you can trigger it and have the guy run back. Yeah. Good. That or have him move up to where that half cover. Once the rest are deployed, Can he not they'll begin transmitting the, a signal the full to cover? confuse the alien. Oh, he did. He just, he just hit it. If everything goes Hold up a second. Plan, I don't know if you want to bring out the full cover, because that thin man is going to come around and just smack you, right? Yeah. Why have your squad members shoot first? Let's see what your rocketeer can do first before you move him. Where can she Let's fire? What she can Now, will that blow up the, uh... It looks like it'll blow up the side of the train. 
Yeah, but will it blow up your your objective? Will that make oh, you lose? I, I don't. I don't think so. No, no, it's not. It's not. The stuff around <laughs> it, it it shows is uh, destructible, but not the thing itself. Okay. So let's do that. Sure. Yeah. Come on, Kotobuki. Yeah, you're gonna have to try to shoot him. Alright, Shiv, this is what you're designed for. That's what he's designed for. Hello, all of oh, you man, flanked he flanks aliens. so much. He's, he should totally hit one of the flanked ones. Yeah. Especially one that the one that's in full cover right now. That flanked one that's in full? Yeah. Yeah. Go for it. Nicely done. Okay. Where's your grenadier? What can he do? Let's see here. Let's not get... much. Yeah, we can get him here. Heading to that location. I don't think his grenade's gonna huck far enough, but he can shoot. We'll see 68. if the grenade can. Uh, um, maybe an HE could hit that guy. No. Uh, no. No. Although, man, oh man, you do want to hit. Well. What? Oh man, a flanked one though. That's really tempting. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna go All for right. that one. All right. Nice. All right, for Logan. You run. can run mm -hmm. and gun. Well, you could not maybe not run and gun, but you could run them to the right there, more to the right, to the right of the shiv, to where uh -huh. that is right there. Like right there, uh, right there, uh -huh. and then run up, got him next turn. Yeah, I could. Um, then maybe best to put him here. Sure, and then maybe you can move your scout to that other square. Rolling out. Because he still needs to get out of the danger zone. Right. But he oh wait, right. I'm with you. Well, you could maybe move another one of your squad members. Well, hold up. Wait, you must have someone else you can move. Oh right? no, 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 I was just. Uh thinking i wasn't moving anything um oh okay you now this one's in a better position to run and gun to like right there and kill one of the wounded ones yeah i really wish you could throw a grenade and run and gun that'd be perfect i know yeah let's do that Ooh, the speed of death. let's get you here Time to motor. because i mean if you kill one of the wounded ones and have david what david um go up and uh, I mean if you kill that closest one to him then you won't worry about him getting flanked and if he goes up then he'll be actually from his current position mm -hmm. I mean it's just really nice that your scout is so mo mobile he can technically run to that second you know objective point trigger it and run back too but right. he has to be saved so I don't know Anyways. okay the sad thing is I want to take this guy out but I only got a 37% chance shot at him I oh, got 68 yeah. at the other guy Go with the 68, definitely. Come on, man. Come on, Percy. Nice. Okay. All right. I mean, if you're really lucky, if Emmer Feely, oh no, he's flanked from there. So even if he threw a grenade or something, wouldn't be so good. But how about you move him, your other guy? Mhm. Mm uh, yeah, you definitely want a smoke grenade. Um, okay, now, here's is, a is smoke idea. still a yeah. free action if I move first? No. So smoke and then move. Or move and then smoke, it doesn't matter. Oh, wait, no, you said it was not a free action then. It's never a free action. What it is is that if you do it as your first action, it doesn't end your turn. Oh, so I, won't, I can't fire and smoke. I got it. Okay. Yeah. Unless I'm not moving at all. Unless you're not moving, yeah. So let's go ahead and put you here. Yeah, there you go. On the move. Yeah, so now you have a choice. Shoot the guy or smoke. And I suggest smoke. I, I concur. All right, now can I get... Uh, yeah, I can. Well, David Emmerfail, you're going to have to move anyway. Because smoke or no smoke, he's flanked. Let's see. Um, Might as well come for two, though. There we go, right you know there. Let's move him, and then we'll throw smoke. Okay. Because we could I would move, not move him right him here. Up. Yeah, move him right there. From right there, he should be able to actually still run to that other node once mm -hmm. it gets clear. 
You'll trigger a bunch more aliens, but hey. Yeah, that's fine. You don't need to get him, too. He's uh, already if, in If I can, might as well. But you can't. Uh, I can't. All right, then. All right, gentlemen. This is a risky mission, Lady. but we can do this. Commander, we have multiple incoming bogeys. It looks like they were air launched from the battleship. Expect new contacts any minute. Air launched from the battleship, oh, really? Oh, joy. See, I knew he was going to do that. Sneaky bastard, but you have a grenade. Hey, damage reduction. Yeah, if you can... Oh, man. That's fine. Take <laughs> shots at my shiv. I'm okay with that. I, like I said, I didn't expect him to survive this mission anyway. He is an expendable resource. As long as I use it intelligently, he is an expendable resource. Okay, that guy's on Overwatch. Uh, and also, hello. Oh, that guy's on Overwatch, too. That's awesome. Not. Okay. All right, uh, don't move anyone. No. Rocket launcher person, though. Unless you want to move your scout, because he can um, trigger all those things. It's true. So you might, as crazy as it sounds... You might want to move your scout out to where that other point is. Oh, or nearby. Oh, you can't quite get to it. Oh, man. If you were in that other spot of that other guy, you could. I could move him here. It would trigger almost everything. He'd be in cover. I would have to make sure to take out this muton this turn. And that other... And that... Uh, this guy and won't that be a man. huge problem, yeah. What do you, yeah, he'll be... He will be a huge problem. No, I'm Why saying to kill here? this turn. He won't be? No. Definitely not. Okay. If nothing else, this scout has an AP grenade that'll finish him off. Okay, yeah. Alright, um, so let's get you oh, here, no draw way. the overwatches. There we go. Incoming fire, incoming fire. Hello. Yes. Alright. Yeah, because he's got to go for that thing next turn. 52, 40, 55. You can't see the muton? No, but you can move right next to the muton. Well, of course, you might not want to do that because you might not want to trigger any more guys. Let's see who else can see the muton. Yeah. Let's see here. Maybe you want your rocket launcher person to kill the muton. You have a 79% chance, but you also have my smoke. Let's see yeah. who else we got here. You have a 60% chance and grenades. Grenades might not be a bad idea. But he's not in cover, though, so... Great, so an HE will be very effective. Um... You think H doesn't AP do more damage? Yeah, AP. Oh, sorry. Did I? I meant a, I meant a, AP. Yeah. So I let's go ahead and do that. You want to move him first and then do that? Never I was mind. considering it. I thought maybe not, because we are in a really hot zone right now. All right. So okay. only two he more damage. Um. She okay. could. Well, how about him with his pistol? Does can he see the muton? No. No, he can't. But I could move him to where he could, and just shoot with his shotgun. Sure. Yeah. Do it. Uh... You can't run and gun anyway. So if he's gonna kill the muton, have him move him right up. Yeah, right there, right in that corner. But he'll be flanked by anyone coming from this side. But you're gonna. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay then. I could move him to here. He'll definitely be able to see him. Sure. Um, yeah, go for it. He has a grenade that he could be guaranteed. Too. Yep, let's do that. Let's be safe about this. Well, you have to be safe and fast, so you have a guaranteed kill, baby. See you in Helm, Muton. Alright, see, so he's flying from there anyway now, so I guess rocket launcher. Let's see. Shredder rocket, what can I do with that? Shred a rocket with those. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Actually, I might be able to be hit able to both. Get both of them. Maybe. No. No. One or the other. All right, let's try regular rocket. Oh man, and that would destroy that guy's cover too. All right, let's do this. Actually, no, because it won't destroy his cover. Oh, 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 oh! oh if I do it there, it will. Yeah. Perfect. Do it there. 
Come on. Aim true. You did not aim true. Nope. Well, poop. It's all right. Uh, I'm probably gonna save you smoke again. Our run and gun. You could run and gun to. Or you know what they could do is she could just move there and huck a grenade and kill that guy right by your scout. Well, my scout also has a grenade too. Well, yeah. Well, why you have his use his grenade against the guys further up ahead? Yeah, I see that one. Yeah. Okay. So you. I'm gonna run to here. You also have a shiv too. Yes, I plan on bringing the shiv up front to not only draw fire, but try and get a really good shot. Uh, I am being a bit suicidal with the shiv, but the good part about that is by being a bit suicidal with the shiv, I am Oh, that's gonna to blow his cover though. Yeah, you're gonna have to be really precision with this because you don't want blowing your own guy's cover, do you? No. So, right, right, uh, it, it, er. What? Can you not get the guy? Oh, there we go. There, there we go. Yep. I love how I love how rockets have to be have have a, a have a scatter, but grenades don't. That's yes. Really funny. I love that. All right, ability. so all right, so then AP grenade. Right here. Yeah, the next turn, which is turn six, you can get to the second one, which is great. Frag out. Problem is, you don't want your other people lagging behind too much either. Wow, one damage. He had he had full cover. Okay, yeah. damage reduction, man. Yeah. Okay, I'm thinking of putting him up here. Okay, you could flush out the guy who's in full cover. Mm-hmm. 40% chance to hit, 54% chance to hit. I kind of like flushing this guy. It's going to make a move. It's going to do You a won't be able damage. to fire again, though. You lose a, yeah, but yeah. It's a really good chance to hit. Wait, You'll have to reload next It uses that turn. much ammo? Holy cow. It uses double, yeah. I forgot about that. Ooh. Well, without, without extra ammo, your ship has three shots, right? So I'm wondering, should I? Yeah, you know what? It's safer that way. Still did three damage to him, not bad. He not didn't bad move! Nope. What? It's not it's not a guaranteed thing. Uh, okay. He had a 17% chance 17% chance to not move, and I guess he didn't want to move. Alright. Uh let's go ahead and smoke you guys. Yeah. If anything, can you throw it a little bit further up? Yeah, let me uh I can move a little bit and then Throw it. Just because I'm thinking of smoking, also having it go over where your second objective is. So if your scout goes there and has to stay there, he has some cover from that. You know what I mean? We'll try it. No. Yeah. Okay. Like, like, yeah. Just that little edge. Yeah. That works. It's better than nothing. All right. I won't be able to oh, smoke there. him though. Hmm. But he is in full cover. He's in full cover. Yeah. All right. Let's do that. There it works. Yeah. Pop and smoke. Oh okay. man, your guy's flank though. He might not make it. He does have 11 hit points though. We'll have to move quickly. He and he is really far back. Oh, um, we'll hope. Take him. Okay. X-rays coming in from the side. Ooh, going at him. Nope. I'm Thank fire. goodness for that smoke, man. Yeah. He's gonna go for him too. Yep. Uh, okay. Good thing you, everyone has a med kit. Yes. Indeed. Okay, so you definitely want your scout to move up and uh, take that thing because you only have six turns remaining and you still need, you still have two more objectives. Moving them there. Moving them there won't hurt. I mean, you can but always. Moving them here, back. I can probably flank the guy. Yeah, but what if you trigger uh, some aliens off the other way? Yeah, you know what? Good point. Might as well. And worst so comes to worst, you move back. Yeah. There oh, hey, you can flank him. Awesome. Yeah, Keep do that bad boy one. first. You've got two transponders now, wait, left. before you do that, mm -hmm. you should make sure you can kill the other guy. Right. Because you don't have a shiv with ammo anymore, right? Right. Like, don't commit until you know for sure. Now, you have one guy with his running gun. 
But if him he's going that far up, there's a really good chance he's gonna trigger more aliens. You know what I mean? Yeah, I do see your point. He does have an HE grenade, which will destroy cover. Yeah. Okay, so here's a crazy idea. Mm -hmm. See if he can't throw his HE grenade in between where that one alien is and in between the two aliens, which will destroy his cover and make, maybe kill the other one. Yeah! So if you're lucky, you'll kill that one alien right there, right? Right. And it'll blow up the cover on the other one for David to just smash. I, I think I need to move him first. Do you? No, you had perfect aim. Well, you yes, I know, but I need to start moving them up. Oh, yeah, good point. Yeah. Um, that's dashing, though. No, there's really nowhere I can move him that has good cover, so... Well, you can just move him where there is no cover in the smoke, but that is leaving him exposed. Yeah. But if those two are dead, then who cares? Right? Well, people have been be dropping from the air. sky. Mm, good point. All right, let's do that. Well, you know what? Catch. What you can do is he can be the rear guard if you kill these two. Oh, awesome. Now, if David kills the other guy, you can just dash all your people in the back back up to the front. You know what I mean? Yeah. 84% chance. Go for it. Do it, buddy. Do it. Nice. Okay. So that's exactly no what you can do now. Ready. Dash everyone else in the back to the front and reload your shiv. Then now you have, you'll have five turns to just get that one thing. Don't have them dash any further than the shiv though, because you might trigger something right. else. Right. But, okay. Okay. Dash you here. Stepping off. I also want to try and get Aisa up to um, the wounded guy, Percy. Okay. Don't have any cover, though. Not really Once necessary. Again, if you don't trigger anyone, it's not really Ten necessary. Four. Yeah. Yeah. You. He just need to. Yeah, reload. just have him reload. For the five turns to get that one thing, thanks to your scout being so close, he can get that within one turn, which is great. And then you know what? Here's a crazy idea. Mm -hmm. You move them up to right next to that thing, right closest to our side, right? You smoke grenade it and have him hunker down, right? So as long as you make sure he doesn't get flanked, he can then make a mad dash the next turn to the actual box car because he has enough movement. And as soon as he gets in there, he, you win, and if people are on Overwatch, he has lightning reflexes. That's brilliant. I love that. All right, so let's do this. All right, so all, yeah, your squad's job is to make sure oh, he doesn't get flanked. Nothing. Perfect. Well, trigger it. You're almost there. Only one transponder awesome. left. Awesome. Just activated. don't have him do anything yet, and move everyone else up nice and careful. Except for I'm actually gonna get uh, Aisa here and heal the guy, and then leave her as kind of the rear guard. Okay, good call. Because good call. he needs healing. Good stuff. I agree, 100%. He definitely needs healing. Rub some dirt on it, you wimp. Love those advanced med kits. Yep. Good investment. All right, Mr. Shiv. Don't need to dash you. I can just move you up and put you yeah, on just Overwatch. Move him up. Yep. If necessary, yeah. Everyone else, you can as long as you don't go any further than the shiv. You can dash them, move them up half. Just don't have, don't have them go too far to the left because I'm t I'm terrified yeah. of. I'm with you. Yeah, have them there and just go on Overwatch. Man, you're you're you'll be in good shape. Right. He has a running gun too, which is nice. You might want to just dash him, frankly. That's what I'm Once thinking. again, you didn't spawn any aliens, so that's really... You, you don't really need to take cover just yet. All right. You... Actually, I can overwatch. You don't have to low profile. Well, me. move your other guys first. No, no, no. To... I know, I know. I was just commenting to myself. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he doesn't even have to hunker down. If there's no aliens, yeah, why does he need to hunker down? Oh, yeah, crap. You poisoned yourself. That's okay. Sorry. Didn't he have? Oh, he, and it's the one guy who didn't take a, a hell of uh, med that... kit. It's all right. If I if I heal him before he takes any damage, we'll be fine. If even he takes one or two damage, out. frankly, he'll be fine. It doesn't go against his hit point, so it won't right. make him, you know, wounded technically. All right, I think we can do this. Okay. And your 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 scout can totally make him that mad dash to that thing. Lightning reflexes, no problem. Double move, you better believe it. He can make it. Yeah, but can he? Can he? So you just need to get in there. 
You just need to get in there. Okay, you you can, I suggest it. saving it beforehand, but I know you just need to get in there. From experience. Here we go. Oh, man. Exciting. I'll tell you when this is coming, because they're jerks. Oh, hello. This is a horrible place for you to be, Yutan. This is a horrible place for you to be. Oh, my God. What? He lived? You know, he's got to be sh shitting his pants right now going, I'm So, what? Give, it a quit, give it a fun save, just in case. In case I misinformed you. Right. Because I don't want that to happen, right? But, uh... But I'm I am 99.999% sure you just get one person in there, you're fine. So find a person that you don't want to move and shoot that damn Utah. Yeah. Maybe you want to your guy with the shotgun, frankly. Actually, not a bad idea. Thank you. Only 44%. Oh, because he it. has, because he's in half cover, right? Ah, screw it. All right, then. Um, he has to be someone who can't move though. That's no, he's flanked. Tricky. Okay. Still only fifty-three percent. You know what? I got a grenade. He's a sapper. Yeah. Let's do this. Yeah, good, good call. Besides, if you plan on just having your guy run, right? Then... Re really? Now shotgun. Now shotgun can do his thing. The shotgun's already done his thing. Oh yeah. Okay. Now this guy, I guess, can do his thing. Whatever, use your pistol. No, you know, I can flush it, make sure I hit that, and kill him. 98% chance, I love it. See you in hell. What? 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 Okay. All right, no, don't shoot with David. Now, right. he's moved, so he's not on Overwatch anymore, right? I'm 99% sure, but just have the shiv move, just in case. Really? Oh my god, really? Okay, well, I'm glad it was the shiv that did it, right? Wow, yeah. That's silly. I can't believe you missed on a 2% chance. And I can't believe the game doesn't con consider them still on Overwatch, even though they just ran for their lives. Yeah, I know. But it's, it's a shame. Plane. No, All right, no. double move, and let's see if let's see if I'm right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He has whoa. to get inside. He has to just get inside there. Uh, yeah. Wait, is there a, th a fourth? Yeah, it looks like there it. is a fourth. Oh shit. Okay, that's. Oh, we should have done the last turn a lot differently. Then. I swear there were only three. No, well we, we were wrong. We so, should, no, you know what? I, I, I almost want to reload that because everything yeah, well, we did, we, we did under the assumption that there were only three. And besides, we didn't. Yeah, that's fine. Let's let's load it. Screw it. Did it do? Did it do? Did it do? Did it do? Okay, so. Do what you will against uh, that um, <clears throat> Mouton. 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 And then I guess move your scout ahead. We've got four turns to. You know, I can I can move the scout ahead and draw that overwatch anyway. Yeah, and that way you can get everyone else in a better position too. Right. So let's so, go and draw you here. I guess as far as you can go, yeah, because you can always withdraw further back in that better cover. Reflexes. Right. Lightning reflex isn't always a guaranteed no, thing. No, it's not. It still drives me crazy. Squiddy, Thin Man. Wait, wasn't there another Squiddy, by the way? Yeah, I thought so too. I'm thinking maybe my rocket launcher took it out, or it's just been in hiding forever. It does that, by the way. They do do that. Okay, don't move him or do anything else with him just yet, but he is definitely going to have to get behind into full cover. All right, so here's but, what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm thinking of moving the shiv right here and then just yeah. m wasting this muton. Okay. And then everyone else can move into better positions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The only thing is that you really want to protect your, um, your scout, right? Right. Because what if he gets grabbed by that squiddy and there goes all his movement, right? Mm-hmm. So, hmm. Let's get the engineer up here. I know it's dashing, but he can't be flanked. Oh, this but he's he, he, yeah, he can. No, but he'll be able to. Yeah, yeah, he'll he'll be able to get flanked. But you can move him there. Yeah. So my suggestion is move everyone else kind of in half cover behind your guy. 
I'm thinking maybe run and gun the assaults here where they can go in full cover and overwatch the uh, engine. Oh, nice. There. Okay. But you'll still have to move your engineer because he's flanked. But yeah, yeah, run and gun both of them. That's actually a really good idea. And heck, what you could even do is run your scout over to those lockers to the right where that's full cover. You mean here? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, except for the squiddy. He'll, he'll be able to... Yeah. Hmm. Oh, he'll have to switch to a shotgun to run and gun. You know what? I might put him here, move Scout to here. Okay, yeah. All right. On the move. Let's go ahead and reload your pistol. Yeah. Uh, Rocketeer. That one you might as well just dash somewhere because she'll want to use that shredder rocket somewhere else. Yeah, I say dash her to like there. Definitely. That way she can at least do her shredder rocket. Um next turn and as horrible as it is she can also be squiddy bait well why don't you move that person to that half cover right there and huck a smoke grenade which oh this half cover yeah yeah that's affirmative just kind of bring it up the rear but there we go and yeah now just move your scout back like you said before have your um, running gunner go on Overwatch, and we'll have three turns to get to that fourth node and then have him run. That's less tricky. Yeah, honestly, I think I honestly think that there's one node too many, <laughs> like one bridge too far. Yeah, kind of like that, but not at all. There you oh, go. Yeah. All right. Okay. Overwatch. The problem is I really want to throw a battle scanner for that other squiddy, but that takes time. Yeah, you need your mobile guy to do what he does best, right? He's on Overwatch, but who cares about that? All right, who are you going to move up? What? No, I don't want to open the door, silly game. Uh, my scout, draw the Overwatch. Yeah. Can he get to that other thing? He can dash no, to it. God, oh, that's to it. that's too dangerous. You still you have three turns, right? Right. So why don't you have him single move somewhere? Yeah. You know what I mean? You know what? And then, and then throw crazy? throw the battle scanner. Maybe. Uh, yeah. Have him move to that half cover right there. Or how about this full cover right here? Uh, I guess, but. I mean, squiddies can flank too, right? You know that they can use their plasma pistols. Right. But, uh... And, and hmm. here's the thing, too. Thin men are really mobile, and they love just moving. Like, unless you can kill that Thin men, I think that's really a bad idea. Because he'll just move to where that probe is so and here. then shoot him. I guess, yeah, sure, yeah. I'm that's better. Move. That's a lot better. Man, you are, you are, oh, lightning reflexes. So I'm thinking if if that is close enough, mm -hmm. as crazy as it is, if his movement allows it. Oh, see, okay. Oh, crap. Look at all yeah. these squiddies. Yeah. I really so now need you to can't... throw a battle scanner, but. No, you can't throw a battle I know. scanner. So hold, mm, you're still not, oh, but you will be flanked. Damn it. I, I'm, so these squiddies are killing me. Okay, just move to where those lockers are with your scout, right? Yeah. Then next turn, he can move to that uh, that probe thing, and the turn after that, he can move to the, the head of the car, right? Right. He, can, he can't suppress, but he can go up and shoot someone, or he can go up right by your scout and overwatch, which why, what might be what I suggest because squids will come for it. Oh, or hit that flanker, that might be worth it. Yeah. And have everyone else behind him do the overwatch. Let's do that. Yes, nicely done. Okay. So we have a thin man and at least two or maybe three squiddies kicking around. But you might as well keep Put that everyone else where they are. Yeah, just in, in overwatch land, frankly. Don't bother Ooh. shooting. Yeah. I'll go ahead and put you up here. Yeah, board. might as well, yeah. Just in case. You... We can't. 
He might be better just to overwatch where he is. Oh, actually, you can move him to the other side of that train. Like, because you know that other guy probably won't flank him. Oh, but Squids likes to. Maybe just by the plant then? Yeah, like right here. Watch. Yeah. On the move. I can see it's only 24%. Yeah, you can flush him out, maybe. It's only 54%. I'd rather overwatch for that okay. Squiddy. Okay. All right. You can still run and gun. So we can run and gun you, him here. Okay. Yeah. At the speed of death. Time to move. That way, your your scout is really well protected. Mm -hmm. And if he has just enough movement, he might have enough to move to where that fourth objective is, and have enough movement to go into the maybe. Okay, maybe I've got we'll one see. smoke left. I could smoke all of them right there. Yeah, might as well because Moving. next turn. Here's the thing, though. Unless you want to save that smoke for in case, for your scout who might be crouched by that fourth That's probe. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, save the smoke. Yeah. All right, Overwatch, Overwatch time, aye people. Aye. I'm ordered. On Overwatch. I'm ordered. The alien ship is almost in position to attack. I know, Bradford. We are aware. Oh, I almost wish your scout actually moved a little bit closer, not in the middle of the lockers, but on the edge. I know, but I, I was thinking at the time, I was thinking one space hopefully won't be the difference, and it's a matter of getting shot at or not. Yeah, well, I have a feeling that. Okay. Well. That's that. All right, so let's see what your movement is on your scout. Yeah, no. He'll have to double move to get to that, and he has to. He has yeah. to get right next to it. So you think so here, move, and then smoke. Move in there and smoke it, and... But before you throw the smoke, shoot... Have everything you can at the, uh... At the Thin Men, so he doesn't right. flank and kill your guy. Actually, and then, you know what? Hang on. Uh, let's see something here. I have an assault. That should have run and gun again. Oh, one turn. I was thinking yeah. the run and gun. Oh, it wouldn't make it there anyway. All right. I was thinking run and gun that one there and then brought him in. That no, not gonna work. So, put you. Here. Oh yeah. Put, oh wait a second. If you put him there, he should he have, have the movement to come do this there and then run and in there. That. He will. Yeah, he totally will. Really though? God damn. I think he will. Uh, do we really want to risk it though? No, we don't. So you better move him right up next to it so he can push that button and then run right into it, right? So your name of the game is to protect him, though, yeah, from the one, squids. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's say eight. And, and dash is just double whatever your first movement is, right? Yeah. So then, one, two, three, four, well, if you five, move to six. Because here's the thing. I think so, and I could throw a battle scanner, which is going to be really needed. I've got three okay. squiddies running around. Okay, all right, okay. So move him here. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Copy that. All right, battle scanner. There? Why there? I don't know. There's it doesn't really matter no... where. Oh, it doesn't I matter where you really... throw it. Oh, I'm pretty sure it does. Uh, it always activated them before. Well, poop. Well, Maybe they changed it for the long war mod. I know that in the past yeah. it didn't matter. As long as there was one active, they were visible. Yeah, this one, yeah, it does. So you, Now you'll just have to, everyone else has to cover them, right? You can't have a squid shoot. I mean, if, if anyone wraps their tendrils around... Yeah, we're screwed. Your scout, you're, you're completely screwed. So everyone has to overwatch on them. Just has to. And you might as well use your smoke too. Yep. I'm on the move. Alright. I'm on the move. Don't club well, yeah, I guess a poison attack's better than nothing. Well, it's not gonna matter, they got medkits. Except for the one guy, yeah. Well, except for the one guy, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't. You could still try to flush that Thin Man if you really want. Uh, I wouldn't risk it, though, actually. Mm -hmm. You don't want to flush him closer towards your scout. 
Not to mention it's such a low chance to hit. Well, 58 isn't super low, but yeah, I agree. Might as well. Actually, wait. She might be able to throw her smoke grenade and overwatch from where she is. Nope. Okay. Then move and throw. Heading to that location. There we go. There we go. Oh, this is bananas, though. I really hope this pays off. Me too. Because tonight we'll lose the mission, period. Right. Of course, you know what? I just realized if it's not going to work out, you can just send someone else to, to uh... <laughs> oh, there's one. Um, send someone else to actually trigger the fourth objective probe and then have David run for the thing, right? Right. Okay, so that's fine. You're you're attacked by a squid, but it's better than the, your scout. So. They're moving around the side. Oh no 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 no! I need it's not gonna be your scout. Okay. Is it? No, no, it's the person next to it. All right, so that was extremely lucky. Now let's see if things are gonna actually pay off, or if everyone's gonna die. My shiv, no. Actually, I think he's, he's still alive. alive. He is. Okay, so let's count things out. So my suggestion, mm -hmm. move him. Don't move him right there. Move him to the, the square furthest. I mean, like, to this the one. right. That one. Yeah, do it. Good to go. All right. Yep, I think you can. We've got it. Yes, All I can. All of the transponders are now transmitting. Now just oh, my God, barely. that mobility. That mobility just saved us. We Look at that. Objective. Just one space. This is why your mobility stat is so nice important, job, children. Man. It looks like all the transponders are in position <laughs> and the train is ready to leave the station. Once it crosses paths with the battleship, the aliens are in for a surprise. Oh I my think. gosh. Everyone's alive, injured, but alive. Well, only one guy's injured. Well, the strangled people. Yeah, but maybe it won't go through their armor. No, well, if only did one or two damage, it's not going to go through their armor. Oh my gosh, that was a, such a tense mission. Can you imagine if you did not put on that, that Kestrel armor? I don't want to uh, toot my own horn. No, this we would have been screwed. No, you're absolutely yeah. right. That, and I honestly think this mission is just too difficult. You have you, you need two more turns at least. Well, it's not too difficult because we managed it, but it's super, super stressful. Mm -hmm. It's more stressful than other missions, frankly. One thing I don't like about XCOM Especially like it's rare, but situations like this, this is a mission you really have to plan for. If you don't come prepared for this mission, which means the first time you play it, either you get lucky or you get screwed. Yeah. It doesn't happen very often though, which is good. Oh yeah. wow! So I've got Percy wounded for 19 days, and then the Shiv. Who cares about the Shiv? Yeah. But Percy, it was for a good cause, man. Yeah. And he deserved this promotion, yeah. dear lord. Our scout, our squad leader. David, if immediately, that was all him. That was all him. So we got Kudos, aggression, man. we got sharpshooter, we got suppression. Now, he was sending me, um, I sent me a PM requesting or suggesting, like, what to choose next, and I think he wanted either aggression or sharpshooter, but as I explained in the last video, with my absent-mindedness, suppression is king. Not the only that, but it's going to stack with the hollow targeting that he's mm -hmm. got. But the ability to control the battlefield when I make derps and activate too many things at once uh -huh. is just beyond useful. So, there you go. And uh, congratulations, Lieutenant. You are now a Lieutenant 3, whatever that means. You're the same as three lieutenants. <laughs> You're better than three of them. So, you know, not many rewards except the fact that we get to do the final mission. Which and that would final actually bring. Gives you, yeah. Oh my goodness! If if your alloy research Remember, thing clicks in beforehand, which be it should, watching. you're gonna get a huge haul of alloys on that mission if you succeed. It's so, tough though. That one's tough. Unfortunately, that last mission, mm -hmm. the last mission, makes this mission look like a cakewalk. Mm. <laughs> Words can I explain how much I hated that that last mission of the slingshot. But I I would much rather have a harder time and not be rushed. Yeah. Good point. 
So, all right then, everyone. Until next time, take care. Bye.